Words have the power to change the world. Gregory Campbell. Uh, curry my yogurt, can coca cooler. Do you now regret talking about feeding the Sinn Féin crocodile last week? <laughs> Words can be unforgettable. The ignoramus who has now taken over the, the, the bigoted ignoramus is now taken over in the White House. Let me just then, in that case, give you this quote. I am pretty repulsed by gay and lesbianism. I think it's wrong. Da -da 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 -da. You can't well, then well, say you're well, not against well, it. Well, sorry, the, the daddle daddle dom it. was the actions. Moral, but, offensive but, and obnoxious, but, but, but you say. I, I, but I will... Is that... Is that, is that but, do you stand well, by that? Well, well I'm entitled to those views, sir. Yeah? Words can be inspirational. Well, guerrilla warfare, that's very inflammatory and indeed militaristic language. But do you regret using the words guerrilla uh, warfare? It, it, because no. obviously, bearing in mind, we've seen current threats to border staff there as a result of these border posts no, duly I... set up. No, I don't at all. And in Northern Ireland, words have been central to our history. Who can forget the words that have been spoken in our corner of the world? The law that they're trying to charge me with was brought out to deal with extreme who to the charge? The first man charged in the United Kingdom is a Protestant from Northern Ireland. We say ever, 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 ever. And recently, more loyalists have been speaking out using their words. Our role as proud female loyalist activists is not confined to making tea, sandwiches and tray bakes in the kitchen while our future is under threat. What is the DUP doing for the likes of us on the road? You tell me because you're here. They're doing nothing. Did you vote for them? Yes. Why did you vote for them? Tell me. Because they are one of the. Well, it was either them or Sinn Fein. But will you continue to vote for the DUP? Yeah. Yeah. Can you see how? To some people, that doesn't make any sense. It may sound stupid, yeah. Let's educate, equip, and empower a new generation of loyalists to articulate their views with reason and persuasiveness. Now, I want to make a point to what. Uh, this no man matter what does to the economy. Yeah. No, this man here at the fair, you know, the, we need to enter the political class, and Chris here talked about we need to be educated. See the notion that young Protestants need to be educated or some, some class thing? It's absolute nonsense. Because see the young Protestants, we are educated out of this, and we will be moving forward, and we will be challenging these things politically. So, so, so Jerry, so see in the next 10 years, Jerry. you'll be challenged. Jerry, Jerry, you're not being, I, I don't be Let's talk loyalism. Let's talk loyalism. Let's talk loyalism. Let's talk loyalism. Let's talk loyalism.